National Weather Service has confirmed the damage in Longview was caused by powerful straight line winds. And more than 24 hours since severe storms rolled through, Swepco says more than 15,000 homes in the Longview area are still without power, most of them in the city. And some may be in the dark until Monday night. Now comes the cleanup. We, we found lots of uh, uprooted trees, a few small pine trees that were that were snapped off, but but very small and very few. Uh, the damage looks to be over about a, a, a mile, a little over a mile from north to south, and the, the damage is, is very sporadic. Uh, and our determination based on what we've observed so far is that uh, we had 80 to 90 mile per hour straight line winds. Other areas without power include Kilgore, Marshall, and Mineola. Swepco says they can expect electricity sometime Saturday and in Gladewater by noon on Sunday.